Today I am in north of Bangalore and I'll be reviewing the project Embassy Springs. You work in commercial or you work in residential or you have some other yes. how many tech parks have been done by embassy? What is the price range from which it starts and what is the end of that price range? This entire thing is rara approved. 60 acres of park. 60 acres of parks. 17 and a half acres of natural lake. Apply by what us. time the entire township would be ready? So instead of odd we we could have used unique plots. Kids pool se bhi ek ek step niche chale gaye. But I do not see any workforce working here. Hi today I am in north of Bangalore and I'll be reviewing the project Embassy Springs this is near to airport it's like 15 minutes drive from here to airport and this is a city within the city it's a integrated city of 300 acres so it's a 300 acres of integrated township where I'll take you through हम ये सब कुछ जानेंगे इसमें कि व्हाट ऑल थिंग्स आर देयर इट्स अ प्लॉटेड डेवलपमेंट इट्स एन अपार्टमेंट्स हियर हॉस्पिटल्स आर हियर सम कमर्शियल पार्टीज हियर फाइव एकर्स ऑफ अ क्लब हाउस इज देयर इन द प्रोजेक्ट so i'll take you around and i'll review the entire projects let's go inside and have a look so before moving in let me show you the main entrance of this township so this is the main entrance as of now there will be two entrances to this township when i'll take you to the 3d model i'll explain you the entire thing over there so i was there at the entrance gate and now i have come to the sales gallery i'll go inside the sales gallery you can see that embassy springs is written over there i'll go inside the sales gallery i'll meet the officials of embassy group and then i'll explain you the entire township hi rahil how are you hi prakar how are you doing all good great such a big project rahil yes uh, before knowing about the project i would like to know about the company embassy as a group sure what do they do and kahan kahan pe aap present hai pure india throughout the india sure i'll go ahead and brief you very quickly so when it comes to embassy group uh, we've been in this business for the last 3 decades all right a little more than 3 decades okay uh, in addition to that we've got uh, 62 million uh, square feet that we've already completed all right uh, we've tied up with uh, various partners such as warbeck pinkis okay. and blackstone all right and we continue to do a great job expansively throughout karnataka maharashtra and tamil nadu while we hold 1000 plus acres okay yet to develop you work in commercial or you work in residential or you have some other A different departments as well. So I'm a part of of the residential team. All right. And uh, embassy has a lot of areas uh, which they have actually ventured into. Okay. So we are into co-working, we are into co-living. We've uh, always done luxury real estate. That's our target segment when it comes All to right. re residential. Uh, we've also done a good amount of office space. Okay. And that's basically embassy office parks. All right. We also launched India's first REIT, which is Real Estate Investment Trust. Okay. So embassy has always. been a leader in innovation in the real estate industry so we are also a, a huge part uh, we play a huge role in uh, you know industrial warehousing as well okay. we also have a ton of hospitality with 543 keys currently completed and with 1100 plus keys that are ongoing as well so that uh, we have tied up with various uh, you know hotel operators like hiltons and the four seasons okay so we've got a good base here So everything is in house in embassy absolutely embassy has all of it and more in house all our properties are managed by our own team called the embassy services private limited all right so that's just one short summary so of since we embassy. are in bangalore yeah. and there are lots of tech parks yes. how many tech parks have been done by embassy so embassy has a tech park such as the manyata embassy manyata tech park is it the biggest tech park in one bangalore? of the biggest yes one of the biggest yes uh, 110 acres of it okay that's a large one yes But in addition to that, we've got the Embassy Golf Links, All right. which is actually in the heart of the city, between two of the biggest hubs, Indra Nagar and Kormangla. All right. And there's nobody else who's got a tech park there in that size. So yes, Embassy Golf Links is one of them. Then again, Embassy Tech Village, which is towards Belandur Sarjapur, yeah, right. catering to the uh, crowd that comes in from those areas. Okay. And uh, the Embassy Kirloskar Business Park, which is actually in North Bangalore. 
uh, we continue to do a lot more uh, we are going to come up with a lot more uh, in terms of the embassy business hub and all of this will be coming up shortly but yes as of today these are the four large tech parks tech offices office spaces that we've completed in addition to a lot of other retail and a lot of other individual office buildings that we've completed all right and today we are at uh, embassy springs yes right uh, what i know that it is a integrated township of uh, 300 True. acres True. more than 300 acres True. right could you please tell me about this so to be exact we are about 288 acres all right yes it's a township like you said it's got everything from a school to a club to a hospital uh, to office space to high street retail neighborhood retail uh, embassy also does uh, you know plotted development inside this project okay. we also have apartments so something for everybody to be a part of all right in at embassy springs so when we talk about the residential apartments or plots of embassy yeah and what about the other so in addition to embassy springs we've got a whole lot more that we've already completed and right. handed over as well we've got projects like the most expensive villa community in bangalore uh which is the embassy boulevard truly par excellence one of the nicest communities to be a part of we've got embassy lake terraces for okay. somebody who's really looking for spacious apartments overlooking the hebal lake that is one of the pioneering projects of embassy uh that we've completed only, only recently in addition to this we've got embassy grove uh for somebody who wants to stay closer to indranagar okay uh, I mean, it's in the heart of the city again so yeah these are some of the ongoing developments of embassy all right and since we are talking about this uh, project of embassy spring it's 280 acres to be very 288 precise. acres 288 mm. acres yes what all do we have here so we've got plots we've got apartments we've got a school we've got a club we've got a hospital uh, we've got high street retail we've got neighborhood retail and we've also planned to do an of embassy office park inside this project as well so when you say embassy office park it's again a replica of tech parks yes so we'll be doing a, a small office park inside the project as well okay. we've got about 36 acres of the 288 acres dedicated for commercial all right yes so we're going to look at commercial office space we're going to look at a hospital we're going to look at the senior living but we have tied up with columbia pacific okay. and manipal group as a healthcare partner all and right. we've also uh basically uh, announce a high street retail inside the project as well all right and what about the locality of this place so when it comes to this particular project we are before the toll that's a big advantage for the, for this project okay uh, and since it's a township so people of all kinds are looking for plots looking for apartments they will be a part of this community overall uh yes we are a part of a village it's a, it's called navratna agrahara okay. that's the name of this locality all right. where we are located a uh, but big advantage for us is that we are before the toll where the last and final metro station before it curves into the airport comes in okay so that's also a big plus as so far this is near to the metro, metro. It's, yeah exactly it's a proposed it's, metro or already a functional metro so you can see that the pillars are already up okay okay uh, that's where the last metro station comes up that's right. it's called sadarhalli okay. uh, that's where the junction uh, of this metro station will be coming all in. right so i would like to know each and every detail about this entire township sure uh, you would take me through it So I've got my colleague Saurabh who will be assisting you and giving you all the details that you need to know about Embassy Springs. Yeah. All right. Uh, so why don't you join me? Sure. Come. All right. Hi. How are how you, are everyone? I am good. How are you? I am good. Superb. Saurabh, I would like to know each and everything about this project. It's a 300, 288 acres of Correct. township, right? Correct. And you have couple of tech parks also nearby. Yes. So I would like to know the entire thing about this project. Sure. I'll do that. All right. Yes. How should we start? Please this way. I'll take you with the whole render. All right. And uh, first, I'll explain you the whole master plan. Okay. With uh, what all the availability is there, what the township contains. Okay. Why it surprises customers to you know buy inside this township, you know stay inside this township rather than investing over here. All right. I'll take you with the whole details. Then we'll have a tour of the property. Sure. So I'll take you first with the entrance which we have like, entered the property to. All right. We are currently at uh, this location. Okay. This is the place where we are. You have come from this side, right? You this have entered the over here. Gate. You have entered from this main gate. You have taken a puppet road. Your cars are parked at this location, and this is the sales office which we are currently standing. All right. The location which you enter the gate that is approximately three and a half kilometers away from the main express highway. Okay. Which is a Bellary road. All right. And uh, this entrance initially, 36 acres of land parcel is dedicated for the commercials. Which has your high street neighborhood retail mall. So the entire wide thing which I can see here, it is all for commercials. All right. Yes. So we, as soon as we enter the gate from here, correct, we'll see the commercial. Yes. Okay. So what we have done is the main road, 
we have kept it open for public. All right. Public can come and they can use the facilities which are present in our commercials for them. All right. Which includes a high street neighborhood retail shops on the left hand side of the main road. Okay. There is a petrol pump inside the vicinity on the right All with right. four IT office spaces done by WeWork Embassy. Okay. It's a co-working spaces. WeWork is a part of Embassy Group in India. We have taken the franchises of those. All right. We are coming up with 14,000 employee space inside okay. these four blocks. These will be all G plus one, G plus two maximum. All Nothing right. more than that. And behind that, we have a eight acres of land parcel dedicated for the hospital. Okay. We are in talks with Aster, Manipal. There is a Mayo Clinic, multiple brands being approached for it. As of today, we haven't finalized the design okay. or the brand who will be maintaining it. But it'll be on a 50-50% profit share. Embassy maintains this uh, whole township and hospital is being run by a particular brand. Okay. A brand who is specialized in that. All right. Behind the hospital, we have strategically placed a two and a half acres of land parcel dedicated for a senior living apartment. Superb. So what we so do the lighted is, apartments which I am seeing here. Correct. It's a senior ones. living apartment. Yes. These are all G plus 18 plus structures. These are located right next to a hospital or a healthcare center which gets developed in another four years of time. All right. Hospital will take about eight years from today. Okay. Healthcare center is getting ready with the apartments. Now these are released, launched basically two months back. Okay. We have recently started it. These are having a comb combination of one and a two BHK. All right. One BHK will start from say 925 square feet built up. Okay. The costing starts from 66 lakhs. All right. Two BHK goes about 1375 square feet built up. Costing starts again at 96 lakhs. All right. We have variations which includes one and two BHK combinations. We call it as a Jodi unit. Okay. There you can combine a one and a two BHK and in a single floor BHK. and make it a three BHK. Correct. All right. We have those specifications available. This is all a you know a, a wheelchair friendly society. Super. You have a healthcare center being managed by Columbia Pacific, which takes care of day to day vital checkups, dietary plans, housekeeping, maintenance, everything. Okay. Being specialized for those. And this entire thing is RERA approved. It is all RERA approved. Super. Everything is entirely RERA approved. All right. So the initial land parcel, as I said, is dedicated for the commercials, can be accessed by outsiders. All right. This is the first entrance. You take this road for a 2.1 kilometer of a stretch, leading to the other side, which opens up to the telecom layout road. Now that is another entrance. Okay. So this entrance will uh, take you to our own existing school. If you exit, you f go 5.3 kilometers ahead. You come to our renowned school called Embassy okay. Stone Hills International School. All right. That is already functional. We are running that school from past 12 years down the line. Okay. We are, that is, is one of the top schools in Bangalore as considered as an IB board. Okay. Which is about 5.3 uh, kilometers away from us. And this becomes a secondary entrance, which eventually becomes a primary entrance in the future. So for entire... 288 acres of this integrated township. Yes. You have two exit and entry points. We have three. Three. There is a surprise entrance which I have kept for you all. All right. So there are three entry and exits. Okay. There is a third one which is in the center of the town. Now this one takes you to the airport directly. From this place. Correct. From this location. Okay. And it goes to the IVC road from this gate. IVC is one kilometer ahead. Okay. From there you go to the airport, Trumpet Junction within a vicinity of 12 and a half kilometers. So how much time does it take to reach airport from this? 15 place? minutes, 15 I would minutes. say, yes. You will also be skipping the toll plazas okay. of Devnali, both the tolls. You don't have to cross the toll on a regular basis. Saves your time and money. And you directly enter the Trumpet Junction within uh, 15 minutes time. All right. And uh, then itself, in the same center road, we have even dedicated a retail shops for the inside community members, which is in a two and a half acres of land. So parcel. these middle one are the retail shops? Yes, this is the neighborhood retail, inside retail. Okay. Which is uh, having your chaos shops, your you know saloons, spas, ATMs, All everything right. coming at this location for everyone. Even the this side of the town can access that, even this side of the town can access that. So whatever I am seeing here, yes. all the lights which are lit, Correct. This is the integrated township integrated of, township of uh, 288 acres, correct. Okay. And the main road of ours, which is an 80 feet road, so it the is entire, a public road. Entire main road, which is from the entrance 1 correct. to the entrance 2. Correct. Is a 80 feet. Okay. And it's a public road. All right. Which divides my property into two segments. So on my uh, on my right hand side, you will be seeing a 40 acres of land parcel dedicated for 16 towers. Okay. Which are the first Alexa enabled smart homes. 
So you mean th this is your uh, integrated apartments? Inti integrated apartments in 40 acres. All right. We'll be coming up with 3,000 apartments, 16 towers over here. All right. Currently, the first phase of these five towers, the colored one, what you are seeing, instead of the white ones, the colored ones, these yes, ones. these ones. One, two, three, four, and five. five. Correct. Okay. These five are already launched. All right. They have you know, specifications of one, two, two point five, and a three BHK. These were designed in the thought process of you know for a millennial crowd, people uh, you know who are uh, finding their home for the first time, newly married couple right. for them. So the dimensions over here is little less. So everyone wants to be with embassy, right? Everyone wants to have a home with Correct. embassy. But our portfolio you know stands above uh, five crores and above. Right. So this segment allows the mid people to purchase an apartment with Embassy Group. So this is a bit affordable? Bit affordable pricing, yes. Okay. And these were the first Alexa enabled smart homes all over India, which were again repeated by other developers surrounding all, right. all locations. These are all G plus 14 floor structures what you are seeing. They will have their own clubhouse and amenities present for them. How big is the clubhouse for them? So this one is 36,000 square feet clubhouse. 36,000? Yes. Square feet of and clubhouse. these are just 826 apartments. All right. Which will be in the first phase. Okay. In a 12 and a half acres of land parcel. All right. The remaining phases will be for these towers, the three, and then these behind towers, the three, which will be launching in another one and a half, two years. We don't have much timeline being given, the exact date being given okay. by our. So those would be the bigger ones. Same dimensions. Same. We don't want to, uh, you know, go above our segment. We want to keep it as that same segment. All right. We will launch the same segment sizes. Okay. If the sizes remain the same, definitely the prices keeps on increasing right. as per the demand. Now, the first phase gets ready by 2025. All right. Okay. By so, uh, work has already started? It has already started. The, the These two towers are at the sixth level. These two are, have, have already reached uh, 12th floor. Okay. And this is at the fifth floor. These so are. If we go to the construction site, we'll be able to see the. We will be able happening. to see the construction happening. Or we'll go and shoot data. Definitely, we can. Okay. And uh, you know, for your viewers, these are all uh, G plus 14 floors. Okay. <laughs> these are uh, you know finishing by 2025 uh, December. All right. And uh, they will have their own clubhouse inside their vicinity. Okay. Everything is sold out. The first phase is completely done. We hardly have units uh, available over there. All right. And it was a really uh, catch in the market segment after the COVID. Okay. So people, you know, without uh, people who are living in uh, rentals or in someone else's home, they right. thought of, you know, getting their own house after the COVID. Okay. And this whole township with 300 acres allows you to have 60 acres of land parcel across this township, which is more sufficient for customers who want to roam inside the you know, township after COVID, uh, you know. 60 acres of what? Parks. 60 acres of 60 parks. 60 acres of parks. Which so are already done. 88 acres, you have dedicated 60 acres of park in park. your township. Correct. Superb. And uh, I would just like to add up that this whole master plan is inspired by MR Springs, okay. which is in Dubai. All right. And the same landscapers who has done the MR Springs in Dubai, which is Cicada Group from Singapore, okay. has done the landscaping at this location. Very nice. So they have dedicated a man-made lake of five and a half acres. They have a natural lake of 17 and a half acres. The concept is of green and blue bases. All right. Multiple places you will get to see water bodies in your shoot. We will be shooting some of the water bodies, the whole man-made lake. So we'll sure. be showing that to your viewers also. All right. This property is launched in 2016. Okay. Where we came up with the plots initially, 2016 November. All right. And this side. All right. So this hole was launched in 2016 at a base rate of 4,350 rupees per square feet. Okay. Today, our rates of this location is at 6,825 rupees per square feet. All right. We opened up this land parcel, the starting phase at 2021 November. Okay. So, talking about the product development, we have this front row, which started selling in 2021 November. Okay. With the dimensions starting from 2256 to 5405 square feet. All right. And then three to four months back, we came up with this location, which is called as a future development. The green one. The green one. Which we are seeing here. Yes. All right. That opened up as estate plots. Okay. Now these are the larger range of plots where you have dimensions starting from 9,200 square feet going up to 13,800 square feet. Okay. Now these will overlook the clubhouse, the man-made lake initially. 
So where is the clubhouse? This one is the clubhouse. This whole is the clubhouse, which is for the plotted development. As I said, the apartments will share a different clubhouse. Right. Plots will share a different clubhouse. Okay. This one is in three and a half lakh square feet built up area, spread across twelve and a half acres. Three and a half lakh of Correct. clubhouse. Yes. Embassy is known to create massive, and give you experience of a luxury. Super. So that's what it is. We are maintaining it. We will be our our highest, uh, you know, uh, uh, service team. Which By when this will be ready? In another three years' time. Okay. And uh, we will be, uh, you know, maintaining it by our own five-star brand. All right. It can be either a Hilton, Four Seasons, or a BLVD Club. Okay. So already we are maintaining our previous uh, Boulevard Clubhouse. So I must say that your viewers must, you know, have a look at it. We have already uh, shown them in uh, YouTube. All right. So all that thing is present. You can have a look at it. That Boulevard uh, Clubhouse is functional. Okay. Completely done. People are residing over there. Rentals are going absolutely immense over there. Okay. It is starting from four lakhs, going up to eight lakh rupees per Rental month. Rental of four lakhs. Yes. Those are ultra luxury villas, which embassy. Right. Did. I'm aware. I've seen those villas. Correct. So those are already done. That was about one and lakh square feet area clubhouse. This is almost three and a half lakh. Okay. So three and a half lakh. Uh, square feet of your clubhouse. Yes. Only for plotted development. So we have opened it for everyone. See now, uh, senior living apartments per person. Okay. If they wish to buy an additional membership of my private club, they can always do that. It is all about the luxury, all about the requirements, what a person needs. Right. So if an apartment per person wants to use that, they can also uh, buy a membership. Now membership will be tailor made. Okay. You can specifically choose certain things and just pay for those. Not. Just pay for everything. So you're not forcing everybody to take all the services. Correct. Super. Correct. Very nice. And all the plotted development people who are buying the plots with us, mandatorily first five years membership is given to them okay. with the plot. Okay. And this clubhouse will have your 54 suites managed by us with okay. a five-star brand for their families, friends, family members. Anyone can access that. All right. There is an Olympic-sized swimming pool over here. There is a warm heated pool inside this. Okay. There is a cafe which overlooks a five and a half acres of man-made lake. All right. There is a thousand five hundred capacity of a banquet hall inside this. There is a Olympic-sized football ground with Olympic-sized uh, elevated tennis courts, five of okay. them, which will be done by us. Hundred plus amenities, all maintained by a five-star brand. Hundred plus amenities. Yes. Super. And the embassy is into food and beverages. They have their right. own restaurants which are functional in right. Bangalore. So those will be a part of it. Hilton, uh, you know, restaurants will come. Okay. We will mix all those and you know try making it as niche as possible from our end. And the clubhouse is all designed by Andy Fisher from Singapore. All right. So it's a reowned art, art, uh, you know, architect from uh, Singapore. So, till now, done. what I have known from you is, uh, you have things for senior living. Yes. You have things for, for an adult. Crowd. Yes. Minimal what crowd. about kids? <laughs> so for the kids, I'll tell you inside this site. Firstly, when you go and visit the man-made lake, okay. there are geese inside this. There are fishes inside those, and then inside the parks, we have a jungle gym for the kids with the seesaw. Oh, super! Everything. There are sports amenities placed in the parks. All right. You have a basketball court. There is a small uh, golf putting in the park for the kids. Okay. So there are renowned people inside this township. Okay. There is a plan of coming up with a cricket academy. All right. By one of the you know top officials who has played with us. Okay. For India. So Super. you will have everything inside this township. It All is right. for an adult if they want to, you know, learn drawing, music, anything. We have the space. So for they them. don't have to go out. Once they enter the main gate and Correct. enter the township, they have everything within the township. Yes. Education. If you are asking me, from class, uh, from from age of three to a age of eighty, everyone can be educated inside right. this. You have everything inside this. Super, very nice. Yeah. So I can see uh, senior living, then commercial here, office space here. Correct. Clubhouse is there. Yes. Next to the club. Apartments are here. Yes. Plotted developments are here. Correct. And then retail. Retail is there. Yes. What are those? So these are the new launches of the plot. Okay. This is uh, officially launching in another uh, say four months timeline. All right. So once we get any information, I'll be more than happy to share All it right. to you. Currently, I would just say that it's a future development. Okay. And uh, these are the uh, low-rise luxury apartments which will come in the future. All right. So there, uh, nothing has been planned as of today. Okay. And yes. what is that blue one? So we have acquired a natural lake. Natural lake. S yes. More like an adopted it for a CSR, okay. corporate social activity. It's a dry lake. We are regenerating this in another 12 years. All right. We uh, embassy does more of the corporate social activities in Bangalore. We have almost 2,000, you know, school being funded by us. Okay. Temples being made, schools being made, government school being renovated by us, and we have taken up this uh, lake 
All right. For renovation. How big is this? 17 and a half acres of natural 17 lake. 17 and a half acres of natural lake. Correct. And what is the condition right now? It's a dry lake. We it's a hardly dry lake. have water over there. But uh, since we saw the rainfall in the past two years, right, there was water at that given point of time. But currently, it is dry. We are promising the uh, government that in another twelve years, we regenerate it with the water, Super. with our own additional sources, whatever is there. Additionally, we will throw it in the lake. There are two fifty-five rainwater harvesters uh, across this township, right, which collect the rainwater, store it in our sump. Access is given to the uh, bore wells. There are 32 bore wells around this township. Okay. If we regenerate that with our rainwater, <laughs> access is directly thrown in the lake. All right. So good so amount. So when you of say throw in the lake, you sh- you will put uh, clean water or a dirty no? It is a treated water. Treated water. Correct. It's a All treated right. water nice. which will not smell. You know, it is uh, clean. So you will even have natural fishes also developing right. in the future. Right. So we might come up with a fishing deck in the center of the natural lake. Okay. If the demand. And these will there. be accessible for the residents. Correct for the residents, for the apartments, plotted development. Everyone can access that except the outsiders. All right, very nice. And then we have dedicated a two and a half acres of land parcel for a sacred garden. Okay. Now we have even done a charity with this con. All. We all have right. got a Jain temple inside this. We have twenty-five Jain community members inside this. Very nice. We have a, a gurdwara, a chapel, and a prayer hall. Very nice for the whole community. Very good. Yes. So all those uh, religious things would be activity would be happening. Correct there. over here. Okay. And embassy has its own substation. All right. So in terms of the power supply, it is 24 bar 7. Okay. We will be having we are having approximately 55 transformers across this township. Okay. Substation is not yet ready. All but right. But once it gets ready, Bascom will be taking up over it. We have okay. our own substation. We will be supplying the electricity as well as the water. For lifetime. What about the water supply now? So inside this, uh, we have 32 borewell points, out of which two are active. Okay. We have three water tankers, uh, which are of 110 kld each. Those okay. are again functional. Okay. With domestic, grey, and uh, fresh water supply. Okay. We have uh, sumps of 2100 kld, which is already active, out of which two are currently functional because not much water is needed. Right. Slowly, slowly, we'll open those up. There are two water treatment plants, two STPs, which are there. Okay. Currently, STPs are not functional. Water treatment plant one is functional because of the capacity. Right. And uh, then we have uh, uh, storm water drainage sic- liquidated everywhere. Okay. We have rainwater harvesters across this township. Right. Which collects all the rainwater, stores it in our sump. Right. And then we have Maple Consultant who is taking care of the Kaveri water through tankers. There are approximately about 15 tankers being brought out inside. So as of now, it is through tankers. As of now, once the entire township is ready, correct. How much time it will take? So approximately, uh, we are calculating about 600 kld of supply. Okay. Which will be ample enough to sustain the whole site. All right. And we have 2100 kld of sump itself available. Right. So we have ample amount of uh, you know uh, supply. By what us. time the entire township would be ready? In another uh, five years. By we are saying years. that our own uh, prospects, like our apartments, our right. uh, in future developments, will be completed. And if you are looking at a stay perspective, that is by livability, right? It gets ready in another uh, two, two and a half years. You can start living inside this township. Already, people have started staying over here. People are already staying. Yes. How many families? Seven are staying? families have started staying. Okay. Twenty-two families have started their construction. Almost reached to so the. So we'll top. go at the site and we can see. We these can ho- have a look at all those. All right. And uh, then in in the center of the town, so uh, Maple Consultant is our partner for the water sourcing, and uh, we have done the water point okay. on the main entrance gate, the one which you came from. All I right. would just like to show you that. So this part of the town. You have entered. Right over here, we have a Kaveri point available. Now, government has planned the Kaveri to go till airport. Okay. We have the point being available over here. Once government gives the connection, we will take the Kaveri point to our water tankers, which are currently functional. Okay. And from there, we will supply the water thoroughly. So by the time by next five years, when your entire township is ready. Yes. So you'll have water supply of Kaveri. Kaveri here. also yes. All right. Hundred percent. Already the Kaveri has reached Tanisandra. All in right. a matter of three years, Kaveri is about to reach to airport. Okay. Metro is about to reach to airport in another five years. This point uh, has the metro connectivity within a vicinity of three and a half kilometers. Okay. So you have everything inside this township. So apart from this 288 acres of your land parcel, which is here, are yes. there any big developers whose land parcel are here? So I would say that surrounding my properties, what all I have is on the right hand side of my whole development. This is all Clark's Exotica Resort. Okay. And Now this green area. Which yes. I can see. Yes. Now just to tell, uh, you know, just to give you knowledge to your viewers, this 
property is 22 years old. Okay. People have already started living over here. All right. This is done. In front, you have a Nagamangala village and a Heginali village. That green area. We yes. go there. Yes, please. So here we have a Nagamangala village. Okay. And a Heginali village over here. There are zero developers surrounding in the front side. All right. Behind the apartments vicinity. Uh, from here onwards, it is all Prakruti Windflower Resort. All right. Behind my apartments. And uh, from this point onwards, you will have a forest land of 50 acres. So this entire area is 50 acres, 50 of, acres forest of forest land. land. Next to a MS Engineering College. Okay. Which is sharing a land. Here is your us. MS Engineering College. Yes. This, this is, is all already functional from time. seven years, eight years down the line. Okay. So you have a gate. This is the dead end. You don't have any road going to that location. All right. That is a dead end. So people will be mostly using this main road and exiting on the other side. Right. If you exit, take two kilometers ahead. Opposite was we have other Savana, which okay. is a mass housing society. All right. It is in 128 acres. And after others, we even have Prestige who was, uh, we are doing a tech park in 206 acres, Embassy Knowledge Tech Park. Okay. And Prestige, after the tech park, they are doing a, a plotted development. All right. They have already started it. I'm not sure about the land parcel, how much it is. So the closest tech park to this integrated township would be how far? Already there is a tech park which is uh, getting ready right, on this you? road by yes. Prestige, which okay. is Prestige Cloud Tech Park. It is in 40 acres, ready by this September. All right. 42 companies have taken up spaces. There are, there is Apple, there is HP, SAP. They have already taken spaces. So big fishes have already come. Smaller ones will just uh, follow them. All right. And uh, then so that are, is... Are the employees of those tech parks or the companies, they are buying here? So we have uh, Prestige Cloud Tech Park, okay. which has, you know, multiple companies inside that. There is Apple, SAP, Make My Trip. Okay. And uh, then there is, uh, uh, you know, those people, the higher uh, authorities, the management people, the lower ones, the new, you know, uh, freshers. Right. Freshers have taken up apartments with us and uh, the higher managements have taken up plots with us. And right. surprisingly, there are customers, uh, you know, who are taking two plots, three plots, four plots together. Okay. Making just one villa. The density Super. is even lower compared to any other development. My major uh, advantage of Embassy Springs would be that it is the least dense project in the whole township. All and right. it, this is the only township which you will get in entire North Bangalore. So people who are buying here yes. are only from Bangalore or people from North India or other it's parts of India, Western ground. or Eastern part of India they are buying here? Across the world, I would say. Across because the world. we have marketed it in Serbia, Malaysia, Australia, Sydney, okay, different parts of the world. All right. So there are investors from across uh, the you know, world, I would say. All right, great. Yes, we okay. have Dubai clients, we have Singapore clients, many of them. Many of the Singapore clients are most amazed by this development because this is done by a Singapore-based uh, uh, landscapers. So they feel it almost the same. All right. Most of the clients whom I have spoken to. It is just like a Singapore-based, uh, you know, uh, design. Great. The the trees, all that is, you know, these are quite hardy trees. They do not require much maintenance, all much right. water, and they have thoughtfully been placed because every road uh, is having a different uh, tree flowering in, in that. Okay. So people will get to know which road they are in because it's a huge township. You might get lost inside right. this. <laughs> Great, great. So what are the sizes of these plots? So we had uh, dimensions uh, which started from 2130. Okay. And it went up till uh, 13,800 square feet. All right. As per uh, today availability, we have the least dimension of 3,600. Okay. And uh, the costing, just for your viewers, it will be about 2.75. Uh, All right. Without the registrations, we can discuss uh, over a cup of coffee regarding the price. Okay. And then we have dimensions going up to 11,800 now. The 13,800s are all sold out. All right. We have 11,000s which are available. And there are few where uh, if you choose to build with embassy, then embassy can offer you some plots which are starting from 5,024 okay. to 7,200 square feet. All right. And which are those? So we have the front row. This will be the entrance for the plotted community. Okay. You will enter through a man-made lake. Right. right at the entrance, the first rows, these okay, ones. The first of these ones. Yes. So these ones, if anyone buys, they have to mandatorily construct the villa with embassy group. Basically, we want to showcase our own facade. 
the okay. facade will be as as per our design all right but the interiors will be done as per your customization as per your taste and requirement okay we plan it according to you how you want what you want all right but the facade we want to keep it on a little higher segment so okay. our uh, prices will be discussed uh, with you uh, with our interior team so okay. they will share you the prices uh, you know you can uh, showcase it to your uh, viewers all yes. right so what i'll do is i'll quickly like to show you some of the you know legendary points what we have with our site it is marked in the plan okay so please follow me so inside this these are already explained to you but these are the, just the renders you know which clients will probably remember all right and get to know what their requirement whether it suits or not they so can we, simply pause the screen and yes, take the screen they can have the screen it. yes correct so inside this we have a senior living first right which is in 2 uh, and a half acres 205 apartments coming in correct getting ready by 4 and a half years with the healthcare center being managed by columbia pacific and then we have the town center plots which are in the starting row and right. uh, those uh, minimum dimension as i said it is 3600 available over there all right villa plots where anything which is not in the town center now if you see uh, this whole part we call this location where you see the built villas yes as the town center okay. and anything behind it is all just a villa plot all right okay opposite to the town center you will see the green land parcel the future development yes those are the estate plots okay okay please so we have the villa plots which are any other plots inside the town these were starting from dimension of type 7 which is the least 2130 61 into 35 35 okay. is on the road all the roads are 40 feet roads inside this all right and then you have the next dimension of type 8 2400 490 square feet 6141 okay and then comes we have uh, type uh, 6 which is 2980 all right then we have type 4 3080 type 5 3485 3600 4000 5400 we have some odd dimensions now these odd dimensions doesn't mean that these are in a prism shape or a you know proper not a rectangle okay these are proper rectangle plots but the sizes of those plots are not you know coming in any of these okay. dimensions all right these are the set plots so instead of odd we we could have used unique plots unique plots or you can call it as you know different dimension plots right we have dimensions uh, starting from 3200 over there okay going up to 9000 square feet all right so we have larger ones also 11800s also and uh, the whole site will only have east and west facing plots superb so it's vastu compliant correct there is nothing towards north and south great great and this is your master layout plan correct acha you are explaining this yes so in this we also have uh, row houses which are in the future development okay nothing has been planned as when or where the location will be all right we'll get back to the viewers once it is uh, on the timeline sure. and then we have embassy edge which is launched in 2019 uh, november already these are the five towers which i uh, showed you This the one, pink ones right. what the you are seeing ones, yes, yes. Where they will have their own clubhouse amenities inside right. there and then you have lake front apartments which are towards your natural lake the okay. the Glass blue patch pro. the yellow ones what you are seeing these okay. yellows so these are your lake front apartments you will be uh, seeing them better over here in yeah, this view right so these two towers these will overlook this natural lake of 17 and a half acres hegrani lake in the future all right and then coming to estate plots like i said we have estate plots in the future development which is marked in this master plan in yellow colors so these you can call it as a unique plots all right which are being coming inside with dimension of 9200 to 11800 square feet okay and then we have a town center in the club which has your clubhouse the man made lake the school and the largest park of the site which is spread across 12 and a half acres okay. more like a picnic hub spot for all the families with maze gardens butterfly parks multiple water streamlines right. going through that and then we have school man made lake community parks now these community parks are the largest chunks of parks what you are seeing over here the larger ones only the larger ones so these are all interlinking each other they so have the community the, park starts from here yes and it goes up to the end of the property the till the natural the property. lake till correct. the natural lake correct okay and this is having your walking and the jogging ways designed through them okay you start your days jog over here 
you right. go point go for a 1.8 km of a walk towards the natural lake directly all right it is already done we will It's go inside there. yes we okay. will experience that all right people have started staying inside so yes most of the things are done inside all right and then we have a lake front promenade that lake front promenade is right situated in the front of the natural lake in a vicinity of 8 acres now this has some special amenities uh, which will be your meditation rooms yoga mats restaurants beach volleyball amphitheater overlooking the natural lake for everyone for apartments plot development senior living okay. everyone can access this it's a common amenity for everyone all right and then we have uh, your sacred garden number 14 which is over here now this as i said is your uh, iskon temple jain temple your uh, gurdwara chapel prayer hall right. comes at this location okay accessible from here all right and then we have a commercial in the high street marked as number 15 over here so the place where we are is this location this is our office as of now right we convert this into a high street neighborhood retail shops on the left hand side of the main road okay and then we have a neighborhood retail which is marked as number 16 now this in this this is in the center neighborhood retail means the people who can access it neighborly where you have a mcd saloons spas atms you need to take groceries kiosk shops everything coming over there all right and then lastly we have hospital so it's a complete uh, you know uh, township and hospital with all the here. amenities the hospital is over here okay number 17 which will be in 8 acres of land parcel currently developed as a healthcare center in 2 and 2 uh, and a half acres within a timeline frame of 4 uh, and a half years all right completing with the senior living apartments super roads are already done we have uh, walking ways jogging tracks cycling tracks being done how Now, much is the open area in this entire 82% 82% 82% is the open, is the open area. area in terms of density itself if you look at it there are just 4 to 5 plots in a acre of land okay there are nothing more than that so Great. you have 40 feet 50 feet 60 feet 80 feet roads all inside right. this township there are 32 parks in 60 acres of land parcel right nice. most of the plots overlook a nandi hill view So, so you have, you have a hill a view. Direct view of Nandi Hills. Nandi Hills from here. Yes. How far is Nandi Hills from here? It is approximately twenty-two kilometers away from here. Okay. So you get a good view from all the roads. If you build the house from your penthouse, you will get the view of all the right. uh, Nandi Hills. So, Prakha, what I'll do is I'll uh, this whole ma- uh, you know development of the clubhouse. All right. I have a small you know expanded miniature. Okay. Let's that location. go and have a look at it. I would like to show you that. All right. Yeah, please come. So this is your three lakh fifty thousand square foot clubhouse. Correct. Yes. Superb. I want to know each and everything up to. Sure. Detail me chahiye. Mujhe sab kuch dikh raha hai. Definitely. So Prana, this is the main road, eighty feet road. All right. Jo public road hai. Jo pure project ko do part mein divide karte. Correct. Kar It is dividing that same project. Right. And this is the entrance for the project. So okay. yahan par humne gate banaye hain. Ji. Jo ki bahar ke logon ko access nahi dega. Right. And this will be the balance of man-made lake, okay. which we still have to develop. All right. Okay, this hole, and okay. इसी लेक के साइड साइड में you will have a Olympic sized swimming pool. Okay. Next to the lake. So अगर कोई swimming pool use कर रहा है, they hmm. can still go and move towards the lake part. No, they cannot. This is an infinity pool. Okay. There will be a separation over here. All right. In the center, and ये जो आप gazebos देख रहे हैं, जी, you will be seeing those in the front. वो जो सामने मुझे दिख रहा है. जी जी जी, exactly. So right. those things will be situated near the water bodies for families to come, okay. reside, enjoy their time. All right. So in this, abhi pool wale area, mein some part is ready. You said this part on the left hand side. What you see, okay. left this of the road. Is... This part is ready with the natural walk. All right. Or between the lake, these parks are also done. There are water fountains, lights, everything functional over there. All right. This is yet to come up, and this hole will be the clubhouse. Okay. For the plotted development people. Superb. And these will be those larger dimension estate plots. Okay. Which will right. overlook the. क्या साइज़ था आपने बताया था इसका? Nine thousand two hundred to eleven thousand eight hundred square feet. All right. So would they have direct access to the clubhouse? Yes. एक रोड क्रॉस करना है. So just road, forty feet road. There is a fifty feet road over here. Then there are some walking paths. Now you know green land. Right. Say about another hundred uh, feet में. आपको clubhouse uh, आ जाएगा. Okay. And this clubhouse will also have this massive uh, Olympic-sized football ground. Okay. Which will be done inside this. Iske andar ka jo part hai. Ji. 
वो हमने आपको उसमें एक्सप्लेन कर रखा है द इन साइड दैट पार्ट यस ऑल राइट सो आई वुड जस्ट शो यू दैट इन साइड दिस यू गेट इंडोर बास्केटबॉल इंडोर बैडमिंटन ओके टेनिस स्क्वाश बॉलिंग यू नेम इट दे हैव इट यू हैव एवरीथिंग इन साइड दिस यू हैव इंडोर हाफ कोर्ट हॉकी हाफ कोर्ट फुटबॉल ऑल राइट इन साइड दिस देर आर मल्टीपल डांस रूम्स स्टूडियोज यू नो फॉर द किड्स यू नो क्रिएटिव यू नो गैदरिंग and then there are uh, you know again like 100 plus amenities which will all be maintained by their five star standards all right which uh, will be lifetime maintained by them okay and uh, in this clubhouse you have a 1500 capacity of a banquet hall all right which will be you know readily used by all the clients even the outsiders can come and book their you know venue okay or a concert inside that these will be the uh, suites So yes, about these, uh, you know, there will be close to about fifty to you know sixty suites. All right. Which will be managed by a good entity. Okay. And uh, those will be open for the people who are residing inside us, for their family members, friends, or All anyone. Right. Basically, anyone can access that. And uh, under this, you have the indoor pool. This is an Olympic-sized, uh, you know, uh, infinity pool. And what about kids' that. pool? Kids' pool will be next to this. So you have uh, you know spaces. on behind side so you will have kids pool coming over here okay then slowly slowly baby baby pool will be even behind acha kids pool se bhi ek ek step niche chale gaya baby pool yeah, yeah. there are nice. there are three types so there is a normal pool kids pool and baby pool wow inside that and then you will have multiple sitting arrangement right across the whole uh, thing you even have a cafe which okay. overlooks this uh, whole lake great in the whole vicinity and uh, inside this there are 100 plus amenities there will be multiple restaurants which will be managed by embassy all right and their own brand hilton or four seasons one of those and i can see large part of your area is dedicated to greenery correct the whole township has more than 20000 trees inside this more the, than 20000 trees inside this and another you know 12000 13000 trees are yet to come up okay and all this is you know all uh, in favor of sikada group who has done this you know immense Super. beautiful uh, landscaping in terms of this i would just like to show you uh, some of the gardens okay the theme based parks what we have like i said every theme based parks is almost 2 2 and a half acres each right so there are uh, there is uh, something called as a football park there is some something called as a maze gardens for the children's play area okay and uh, there will be some reflexology path herbs and spice gardens for the senior living people okay to come down and you know uh, get their things right and this is a junior park where you have a seesaw all those kind of things for the kids there's a gulf pudding also coming in there are some uh, family park with the uh, you know certain uh, amenities like a uh, barbecue pit areas. stop okay. uh, you know uh, some counter tables for them to organize their own party inside the parks all right with a member of say about 10 to 12 members just keeping the project team informed they can have this. a small picnic correct they can do that okay that is the reason you know people who are Uh, buying the plots near the park they'll be more accessible to that right that's the whole thought idea about uh, you okay. know this township and you have even uh, selected the trees, trees plants correct and trees. correct these are all hardy trees do not require much uh, maintenance or water okay so these have been specifically you know uh, designed for this site as for the whole uh, you know uh, seasons what we see in bangalore okay. there is they have been specifically taken all the 80 feet roads has more of a gulmohar trees which covers the whole road makes it look like a boulevard all so right. the main road is called as embassy boulevard road okay because of uh, that small aesthetic what we added to very this. nice and this is how you will manage your water yes water. so this is the sumps these are the uh, bore wells there are water tankers these are the stps so we uh, take the uh, you know stps we take the water under the water tankers we clear it up from the top we are surrounding uh, you know flowing the water right. throughout the city then the water harvesters will actually fill our bore wells our sumps everything okay. access water is directly thrown in the lake from a storm water drainage all right and if you see this is the way the location of the you know water comes connects through our uh, man made lake goes down and drops to the natural lake so all wherever right. you see the water flowing you get more of the irrigation greenery right you know coming right. in so that's how we have planned it all and i can even see that you have planned roads correct 
so in terms of the road connectivity this is all this is the water harvesters how we have done so every 30 meter down the line you'll get one water harvester with the main socket okay so every 30 meter down the line you get one more water harvesters with the main socket then you have a cycling path walking path totally secluded so this one what you are seeing outside my property there are two parts so this one is a walking and a jogging track all right opposite to us on the other side of the road yes that is a cycling track it is secluded okay. there Very is nice. no other property which gives a seclusion on this right and then we have planted the trees also specifically designing on the roads so every road has a different trees okay coloring flowering trees so you can easily get to know which road you are in Very so they nice. don't get lost inside this whole township so you have visual indication for all the roads correct and every road is named you will be easily like once you stay inside the property for 2 to 3 hours you will get to know which location you are in okay and this is the entry points what we have you know shown you these are the these three are the main entrances and this is the internal roads connections these are the park connectivity what we right. have shown inside this now we'll go to the, those parks and have a look yes we can definitely do that all right and this is a causeway junction so i would uh, like you to clearly look at it you know we have done this causeway junction i would like to i would like your viewers to see this on actuals acha it's already done yes it is better than the one what we are showing in the renders okay and these are the bus stops which is designed on down so there will be 22 bus bays across this township which right. will have your our electrical buses running in super for dropping all the clients from one location to the other very nice so let's go outside and have a look at the green yes area. please so we have a sacred garden like i said the iskon temple gurudwara chapel all that right that comes something like this okay whatever we are showing it will be better than that you have already you can already see the bus stops what we have done right the images and the actuals one can be you know looked from your own eyes okay so you can get to know how much we can match to our renders All it right. is actually better than what we are uh, proposing to the clients inside this we have multiple nature walks with the water stream lines going through the plot okay so these are ready yes the water stream lines all that through the park is ready okay and this side uh, you will see the whole man made lake which is the remaining balanced lake we have done this side of the lake this is yet to come up all this right okay so this will come up in next 3 years correct and this is the current lake have a look at it everything is as per this it is even better than this i would all say right. yes even the trees the color of the trees yeah are exactly as per the size superb and if you see the entrance of the gate you had those large red stones right so this is how it is it is even better than this i would say correct the red stones have come even better than that so as you can see the work is almost started right log aane lag rahe hain they have started the construction there are seven family members who have started staying inside this okay i can see couple of uh, yeah how is being done yes yahan pe ho gaya hai yeah, wo ban raha hai getting ready right that is also getting ready two behind. are ready here yeah yes there is behind and yahan par samne mein piche mein wahan par reh rahe hain log okay the yes the last wala and that this is almost getting ready very soon Ah, uh, this is almost ready. Almost ready. Finishing हो रहा है, white wash हो रहा है. Okay, and I can see यहाँ पे भी काम चल रहा है. Correct. Services and all are done. Yes. Services inside the plot, if you like to see, please. I yes. Just uh, show you this. आप जो भी ये pavements देख रहे हैं, firstly, these right. are compressed gravel stones. Okay. ये आपको दूसरे plots की तरह like uh, serrated tiles नहीं मिलते हैं, which chips out after two years. All right. They have the tendency of more than two hundred years inside there. Superb. You are allowed to make a basement on these plots. So from here onwards, you can do your basement. Plus two, all right. G plus two is what you are allowed. Okay. Inside the plot, if you see these four blocks, right? G. In this, say, these two blocks, which are your electrical linings, Ethernet linings, communication wires, water inlet or water outlets, are there. All right. Your water outlet is present over here. There is a pipe which again sewage. Are there. We have made it before. We have given it to you. So you just have to put the connections on this. Okay. And it's a plug and play plot. All right. You immediately can start the construction. सब कुछ बना हुआ है. All these linings are coming in these pavements. Okay. So pavements are being maintained by us. The road. So पहले plot, फिर this uh, green area होगा और ये pavement होगा. Correct. This here big uh, tree will come. Then the 40 feet road in front. Right. And that side you again have a plot. Okay. 
एंड नंदी हिल्स यही से दिखता है वो स्ट्रेट आगे आई डोंट थिंक सो कि इससे दिख रहा होगा इट इज लिटिल क्लाउडी ओवर देयर राइट तो थोड़ा ब्लरी दिख रहा है और एल्स यू गेट अ गुड व्यू ऑफ नंदी हिल्स जो आई आई कैन सी इट कैमरे में दिख रहा है या दिख रहा है मुझे नहीं पता आई कैन सी इट यस एंड पर्सन हुएवर डज द पेंट हाउस नो ऑन टॉप राइट सबको नंदी हिल्स का व्यू मिलेगा बिकॉज़ इट इज द लैंड इज स्लोपिंग डाउन अगर आप देख रहे हो राइट एंड मैंने देखा कि इट रिसेंटली रेंड couple of it minutes back just rain hai na for 3 4 hours yes but yahan pe pani to bilkul sukha hua hai all these are water harvesters agar aap samne mein black spot dekh rahe hain jitni bhi jagah pe these are all the water harvesters being placed across the whole site all right so ye pura ka pura water drainage ho jata hai and the road road is sloped on either sides right so zero I can see water that. of uh, you know zero water is staying on the roads we are reusing it very well it is well planned तो प्लानिंग के थ्रू ऑल दैट आर एस पी वट एवर दे हैव डन दे वेरी वेल प्लान इट वॉटर रिड्यूजिबिलिटी इज ऑलमोस्ट अपू सेवेंटी परसेंट हो गए ग्रेट ऑल राइट अब कहाँ चले हम सो आई जस्ट टेक यू फॉर अराउंड एंड विल गो हेड फॉर द स्कूल एरिया ओके या सो करेंटली वी आर एंट्रिंग द कंस्ट्रक्शन साइट ओके ऑफ आर अपार्टमेंट्स तो यहाँ पर जैसे मैंने बताया था कि द फर्स्ट फेज इज गेटिंग रेडी राइट सो वी हैव द कंस्ट्रक्शन गोइंग ऑन Okay. There are five towers in this. All right. You are seeing the uh, front. You are seeing these uh, two towers. Okay. The one which you are seeing in front is a uh, elderberry one. Okay. Behind elderberry, we have the other crane. All right. Which is placed on the daisy. Okay. On our right hand side, we will see the two higher towers. Right. The apartments which you are seeing on the twelfth floor. Which is the right hand side one. The right hand side one. That okay. is hibiscus. Okay. On the left hand side, we have the fuchsia. All right. Which and is and behind me, yes. जो आप छोटा देख रहे हैं, इसलिए third floor, में. extreme end. That is the gardenia one. All right. Total मिलाकर के, these Gee. will have 826 apartments. All right. Clubhouse will be somewhere over here at this location. All right. And these will be getting ready by 2025, uh, you know, uh, September. Okay. As But all right. But tell me something. Tell. Ask me. मैं under construction site में आया हूँ. हाँ. And at this point of time, it's five o'clock in the evening. Correct. But I do not see any workforce working here. Okay. Just to answer this, you know, in embassy, from the top management to our lower, you know, working ground staffs. Ji. We respect their family time. Saturday, Sundays, there is no working. All right. On the side. So Saturday and Sunday they are having week off. Correct. Okay. It's something like so a week off. In a normal day, in a weekday, if I'll come, how many laborers or how many workers I would uh, see here working? In the apartments. It is not, you know, the, as per that flow. All right. So currently, हम लोग यहाँ पर बस 150 लोग डाल रहे हैं, okay. which is more than sufficient enough for us to construct that as per their uh, timeline phase. All right. But in the school, you will notice that the construction is going on today. Okay. It is as per the company's demand that that school is needs to be ready by next year. All right. So जितने भी labourers हैं, extra work flow goes over there. Okay. We finish that. We get the amenities running inside. All right. Uh, people from outside come inside. That's when the development. So, like the way I saw that, जो आपके plotted development है, you have done almost all the utilities. You have completed the services Correct. and utility work already. Yes, because in a plot there is nothing much to do. Right. We just have to lay the ground, pipes, electrical linings. दे करके we just have to do the connection. Plus horticulture, electrical works, everything is done. Correct. So, that is a plug and play plot. All right. Over here, the workflow is still not at its pace. Okay. We are not delaying on this. All right. So you are confident that by the end of your rera timeline, you'll be able to complete this project before that. Before that. Yes. Superb. Very nice. Yes. अब हम कहाँ चलें? So I will first show you the school which is right opposite to us. All right. Right opposite to to these apartments. Okay. You get a five and a half acres of land parcel for the school. Now yes. this is school. सामने वाला. सामने में जो है. Okay. It is under construction. This is spread across how many acres? Five and a half acres. Five and a half acres. Yes. All right. Close to about twenty four hundred students capacity is there. Okay. And then uh, it is functional from nursery to sixth class. And I can see uh, there are workers who are working yes, there. Yes. Yes. There are. So all it right. is all depending on what we need, what the management needs. Okay. At a particular given point of time, because this needs to get completed before the apartments get ready. All right. So that the people can simultaneously. And at the end, service. there are three water tanks. Correct. Those are already functional. 110 kld each, which I explained in the site. Right. These are with grey water, fresh water, domestic water right. supply. And this is your 80 meter wide road. Correct. So your edge entrance is not this one. Okay. This is our uh, overloading trucks entrance. All edge right. Edge entrance becomes this too. Okay. Entrance and exit is over there. All so right. So you will get a similar gate. Okay. Something like the main gate where you will enter the vicinity of the apartments. All right. So behind me you will see the apartments. Right. And just uh, behind you. You will see the construction of the Embassy Academy School. Okay. Which is happening. 
as i said ready by next year right the so, work is in full flow so this is the main entrance of your academy yeah the academy will enter from the main road okay this is the entrance for you to go to the airport directly this is the third entrance which we are okay. standing at this road right will take you to the airport okay we are standing on the road which also has a neighborhood retail shop right which has your inside details correct so this is that road okay so on your left and right here yes. we will have the retail shops correct Bef after the school we have first the clubhouse okay clubhouse will have this uh, football field coming in all right and then you have the retail shops all right after that and behind us these all will be apartments it is 40 acres of 16 towers which i told you right these are the future launch apartments which will be coming up over here and the lake you were talking about the natural lake goes over this side it's at the end all right if you exit it you exit to the secondary entrance which all becomes right. the primary entrance in the future okay so you will enter from the other savana side stoners international school right that location and you can go to the airport like this okay and this is the school right next to us on the left hand side where we have the water tankers right under that till the end whatever the land parcel you can see right it is all a park okay it is a 12 and a half acres park Super. this is the largest park of the site situated in the center of the town so very that nice families of plot development apartments can use it at, as their picnic spot great so sort of we have covered almost entire thing correct 288 acres looks magnificent it's very big thank you so much and whatever i have seen it's full of greenery yes it is and it i is. can visualize that by next 4 5 years or maybe 6 years down the line correct people would try to buy something they would be searching for something and they would not get it yes absolutely this yes. do you yeah. think anything we have missed out well uh, if we have missed out anything okay i can just uh, you know ask the whole viewers to give a call to the number which is being displayed in your screen and feel free to come to the site for a site visit it will enable us as well as you to get to know more about the property and for us it will enable us to get to know about more of your requirement how we can service you and how we can take it to a win to win situation all right so in case uh, those who are watching this video in case you want to have your site visit scheduled or you want to know about the layout plans or you want to further know about more detailing of this entire project or entire integrated township you can simply call on the number which is given on the screen and we'll schedule your site visit here thank you so much thank you thank you